Authorities continue to investigate the shooting in a suburban Minneapolis neighborhood that left two police officers and a firefighter dead early Sunday. The shooting occurred as officers were responding to a domestic situation involving an armed man who had barricaded himself inside with his family, including seven children. The shooting in Burnsville resulted in the deaths of 27-year-old officers Paul Elmstrand and Matthew Ruge, as well as 40-year-old firefighter Adam Finseth. Authorities say Finseth was shot while giving aid to an injured officer. The suspect, who was found dead, has now been identified by several media outlets as 38-year-old Shannon Cortez Gooden. Gooden had a history of domestic violence and was not allowed to possess firearms due to a 2008 conviction of second-degree felony assault. Investigators are still putting together details of the shooting. None of the seven children were hurt. Law enforcement said Sunday that several guns and large amounts of ammunition were found in the home. Law enforcement agencies from around the state are extending their support for the fallen police officers and firefighter, many in the Lakeland viewing area, posting on Facebook, extending their sympathies, thoughts and prayers for the victims and those who knew them, asking people to honor and pay tribute to their bravery and sacrifice, reminding us all to remember their selflessness and to pay gratitude. Lakeland News is member-supported content. Please consider supporting Lakeland News today.